My name is Vicky Bokri and I am the founder, creative director and choreographer of Uchenna Dance. We are a dance company that believes that everyone should have the opportunity to experience great art and we do this through the medium of dance. production is called Our Mighty Groove and it's all about the first time that I went to New York and I attended an underground house club. I really try to take people on a journey. All of the concepts, all of the ideas that I have are things or uh, moments in time or experiences that I have personally been a part of. I had my back up against the wall for like two hours in this club because I just felt really intimidated. I wanted to dance, but I was just already telling myself I wasn't good enough. And I had something like four moves that I could remember, and I just started doing them on a loop. And it was just four moves, but these performers, these dancers, and they were just, you know, different ages. They weren't all professional dancers. Just gave me so much love and encouragement. I felt like Janet Jackson. From the get-go, there's no seating. You walk in to an open space. It's a club environment. I might be a performer and you might be an audience member and you don't even realise it until the piece starts to unfold. Those people that start off being freaked out by the end of it, they didn't want it to stop. Well, the movement vocabulary in this piece is comprised of about five different styles, being African, house, voguing, contemporary, and whacking. So I specialize in a style called whacking, which is a style from the 70s, uh, done to disco originally. It wasn't called whacking when it was first made up, because um, it was just made up naturally, because it's a street dance style. Um, but eventually it was renamed Whacking because there was all these arms whacking. So, yeah, that's how the name came about. So one minute they're in a contemporary mode, and the next minute they're in an African mode, and the next minute they're in a Whacking mode. Uh, the audience is constantly left, or literally on the edge of their feet. It brings energy that you couldn't imagine. My character, she's very bold, confident, just I've got it going on kind of thing. But in real life, I think there's elements to me that are like that, but I am not like that at all in my real life. But this one is, her character is. <laughs> yeah, I think it's different for me, but I think that's why this experience is great, because people come from such different backgrounds. For me, it's very close to my real club experiences and how I am in the club. So for me, I'm so enjoying bringing that to the theater instead of just to the club again. So in this piece, my club personality is allowed to exist. Um, and that is more than fabulous for me, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> When I was a performer, I realised that when I was working with the not-so-nice choreographers, my performance, how I felt about myself, it was just really bad, it was really low. And I one day just thought, if I could turn that around to make everyone that I connect with, everyone that I work with, whether you are a dance enthusiast, you have two left feet, you're training to be a dancer, or you're a professional, if I can make you feel great, if I can make you feel good about yourself, everything that we do together is going to be amazing. Fierce, fabulous and free. <laughs>